What's up guys? Uh, doing a quick pickup video, uh, mostly Garbage Pail Kids, uh, a couple other things, and I did get all of these from one seller, uh, so it's kind of like a package uh, deal from him, and uh, let's get to it. So uh, first off, I already did have series 11, 12, and 14, but mine were missing uh, the variations on uh, series 12. Uh, and they weren't in mint condition or, in my opinion, you know, condition for me to put into my collection. I like all my cards to be pretty mint. So um, you can see right here, these cards aren't in bad shape. Um, but these ones were the ones in my collection. You can see this one's got like a little brown, tiny brown stain. I'd rate these cards at a 9. Um, so I saw that he had a bunch of sets on there and I got them all um, for a good price so you could tell the difference right here this is the set that I got from him the cards are as mint as you can get um, I'd say even gradable uh, I'd say at least some of these cards are 10 out of 10 some are nines just because of the borders themselves but Cards themselves, nice white sides, uh, no gum stains, no wax stains whatsoever. This one does have all the variations. And uh, I'm just going to keep these, keep these uh, boxed up and in my collection. Uh, and the other ones I'll handle more. But I just wanted to uh, post these up for a video. So I got this set. Uh, picked up this set and again these cards are you can't get any better they, they're nice and crisp the uh, corners are nice and sharp uh, no wax stains on any of the fronts or backs um, cards are nice and centered and it feels like he just bought a couple boxes and just made some uh, sets out of packs so very nice condition um, here's my set and series 11 didn't have any variations but and these ones are I'd say at least 9.5 out of 10 so the only reason why I picked those up is just to have another set I almost have uh, two sets of everything uh, series 2 I have 3 sets, and Series 3 I have 5 sets, Series 4 I have 5 sets, Series 6 I have 2, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, those are all uh, 2 sets. Um, still missing a couple cards for Series 13 set to make a second set, and then I need the non-die cut for Series 15. Um, and here's the uh, set I got from him. For series 14, this one does have all the variations. And uh, I was missing two of the variation cards for series 14, so picked those up from him. Here's my my set right here. This is it, the one I bought from him. These are sets from You can see, I mean, they weren't too bad, but pick those up. So, uh, let's get to the next thing. I got some uh, Masters of the Universe 1984 cards. These are just the sticker cards, and these ones are in great shape. Got them for a good deal. Um, got Tila, He Man, and Battle Cat. Ram Man, one of my favorites, Sorceress, Skeletor and Panthor, Manny Faces, Man at Arms, Tila, Skeletor, Guardians of Eternia, and these ones right here are just uh, battle scenes. And, uh, it actually comes as a set plus the stickers, but all I have is the stickers. I got 
actually five sets of the stickers. Um, so if anyone wants to do a trade for, for any of these, let me know. Um, and uh, one of these days I'll do my collection of He-Man figures. I uh, have a bunch of those. Um, pick these up. These are the uh, Gremlins 1984 movie cards. Full set with the wax pack. You got the stickers in the back. 82 cards and then uh, I think 11 stickers. So uh, pick those up for cheap price. And uh, I'm really uh, trying to get some uh, Ghostbusters cards, the, the boxes themselves. Um, seen on eBay, there's one where he's got four boxes for one price, and uh, probably pick those up soon. Pick these up. If anyone uh, remembers sticker cards, um, you'd get a sticker album. I used to have the Ninja Turtles. You'd get the little packs at the grocery store in like the uh, checkout aisle. I know they they have them now of like Barbie and stuff, but these ones, uh, 50 uh, stickers. There's six stickers to a pack and then there's 50 packs and these were 40 cents. And you stick them on the sticker album. I don't have the sticker album, but uh, pick this up. Full box. Uh, little uh, bent right there, but it is a full box. And uh, pick that up. And uh, pick this up. I got my uh, card last week and uh, picked this one up. Just got it in the mail today. I was waiting uh, to do a video before I got this. And uh, I'm going to get this in a nice case. But the. Uh, difference between this one and a lot of other ones that I've seen uh, is this thumbprint actually right here is an actual thumbprint uh, you can actually see the lines from the artist pushing in his thumb for the art it's got the yellow back and uh, I just pulled this out just to show the detail of it I uh, picked this up for a pretty good price and uh, could be putting this in a nice case. Uh, just have it in a top load uh, penny sleeve and a top loader for now. But I just got it in the mail, so that's it for uh, pickups. And uh, one thing I did otherwise, let me take you over here is uh, got all my cards, Series 1 cards, Series 1 through 7, put those in a uh, binder. So uh, these are the all the uh, Ultra Pro sleeves. I'm missing about 30 cards for Series 1 through 7. I do have uh, an extra set of Series 2 uh, a bunch of Series 4 cards, another set of Series 7, and another set of Series 1 except one card um, for trade. If anyone has any cards that they need, um, help me complete my set. And, and then I will finally have a whole set of Garbage Pail Kids until the Flashback 3 comes out. And I actually just uh, pre-ordered a case. So I should be doing some videos on those when they finally come in. Um, but go through some of these. There's the uh, sketch card right there that I got. Got some of the inserts, the scratch and stink cards. And uh, up in the top corner I put one of the wrappers for each set. So you can see up on the top, right there. So, 
anyways guys uh thanks for watching it's, um, it's supposed to be a quick video but it's turned into 10 minutes and uh if you guys do have any uh cards um i'll pm you what i need and uh, maybe we could do a trade all right thanks guys